Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we've got an exciting opening. We get to take a look at Legendary Collection 1, the Game Board Edition. Uh, there were two versions of this made. Uh, the original one was a binder uh, and it's now currently going for like $400. Um, they did reprint it once uh, with the Game Board, which is what we've got here in front of us. And then in a couple months, uh, towards the end of April, we're going to get to see another reprint for the 25th anniversary. So it's going to come out, it's going to have some 25th anniversary markings on it. And then we're going to get to see the new quarter century rare, uh, which is going to be a new rarity with uh, one of the promos, either uh, Slifer, Obelisk, Raw, uh, Red Eyes, Blue Eyes, or Dark Magician are going to come in this new special rarity. So it'll be interesting to see what that does. Don't know if we're going to see the game board or not. Uh, don't know if that's actually included in there, but haven't got to open one of these on the channel yet. Been a few years since I've seen uh, one of these in person. Uh, never actually got to open it myself either. So figured I'd take a look at it. Uh, not something I would really advise opening uh, if you're looking to keep value to it. Uh, it's kind of hard to maintain the value on these type of things uh, once you break the seal. But where's the fun in that? Uh, before we get started, I want to announce that we do have a giveaway on this. We're giving away a copy of Mechanized Madness, uh, the structure deck. So uh, be subscribed, leave a comment, and you'll be entered to win that. But let's bust into this, take a look at it. Uh, like I said, uh, if you're looking to hold a value and you got one of these, don't open it, don't break the seal. Uh, they're worth much more sealed probably than you'll get value. But uh, we don't believe in that around here. We, uh, we like opening things. So, <laughs> maybe not the, uh, I'm not the best person to take advice from on investing in cards. I, I collect them, I open them, and that's what I do. So, we'll save this box. This is a nice box to keep stuff in, uh, but uh, it's going to be fun to get this open. So, take a look at it. We get this uh, game board right off the top, so we might bust this out too. Game boards are nice compared to binders because they're not too large and too gigantic. I don't have to move the camera around too much. So we got everything just busted. Woo! So we'll give you a little bit of a zoom out here. We got Slifer all the way around. We got Obelisk, got Raw here. Let me flip it over. It's two-sided. And then we got, got our protagonists. We got Yugi, we got Joey, we got Kaiba who obviously should have been the protagonist of the show on the other side. So let's open, let's put this in the background. We'll open, we'll open with this side on us here and move the light out so we don't get a little bit of glare. And then of course, we got our cards back in. We got our promo pack here. So we got all the promos are within this pack. We'll see how well they uh, they look. I'm gonna have to bring the light back. Probably uh, probably you should keep those sealed uh, if you want to you know keep your value. But again, everything's pretty decent. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna open everything because that's what we do. So we got Obelisk and we got Slifer and we got Raw and then we've got the blue eyes and we've got dark magician and we've got the red eyes all these actually look to be in pretty decent condition they are a little bit bent or curved and then they can't be fixed by a little putting them uh, under something heavy with a little sleeve on them to straighten them out might try to send these off and get them graded just for uh, fun after we had that uh, one set and you get six packs and all of these are going to be uh, reprinted as well this year uh, as part of the 25th anniversary. They're all getting booster boxes except for Dark Crisis. Dark Crisis is not going to get a booster box. Uh, so a little bit unfortunate there if you were a Dark Crisis fan. I uh, don't know how many people actually are. But you get Dark Crisis, you get a copy of Invasion of Chaos, you get a Spell Ruler, you get Pharaoh's Servant, you get Metal Raiders, and you get everybody's favorite, Legend of Blue Eyes. So we'll go through, we'll open them, see what we're going to get. All of the other five are getting copies uh, as a new booster box this year, so 
That's going to be really awesome. They'll all have a 25th anniversary little logo up here on the top in the corner. We're going to open a lot of those probably. Really looking forward to that. Um, so we'll start us off. We'll get Dark Crisis going here. We'll open it up. We'll see what we can pull. Uh, probably not a lot in this set that's worth anything or big hits. I think Skill Drain as a, uh, a rare still sits out there as a, as a pretty big pull. So we'll go through. We've got Dark Scorpion, Gorg the Strong. We've got Shadow Knight, Archfiend. Gravity Axe, Grarl. We've got Precious Card from Beyond. Oh, I saw a Trap Card. Skill, oh, oh, we got Skill Drain. Oh my gosh, we've been blessed. This is like a $10 rare. Let's go. Let's go right off the bat. This is, oh, this box is lucky. Ray of Hope. Oh, Gaga Gigo. Is Gaga Gigo pretty good? There's a comment. There's some pretty good comments in some of these sets. Mustering of Dark Scorpions. Oh, we've been blessed. Keldo. Oh, we've been blessed. Right off the bat. Oh, where are we going to go next? Where are we going next? Should we go with uh, Invasion of Chaos? Invasion of Chaos, I think, is probably the next one I want to do. Ooh, boys. Oh, boys. Skill Drain Rare. Only, I think, like, Exodia Necros is the only thing. Oh, man. Oh, oh, man. If we pull off, what is this? Uh, we got Spell Ruler. No, Invasion of Chaos. Dimension Fusion? i pulled Dimension Fusion before, haven't I? Uh, on one of those, like, mystery boxes. We got Desk Kangaroo. Because uh, Chaos... Uh, Dark Magician of Chaos is pretty good in here. Heart of the Underdog. Thunder Crash. Uh, we got Robin Zombie. Do we get two? Do we get two? Come on. Earth Chant. Oh, man. Thought we were going to go two for two. DNA Transplant. Curse of the Forbidden Spell. And then Cannonball. Spear Shellfish. I think Dimension Fusion is the best card in the set. Uh, as opposed. Uh, in the Unlimited City. even beats out uh, Dark Magician of Chaos and uh, Chaos Dragon. Let's go to a Spell Ruler. I think it's Tune Cards. Tune Blue Eyes and uh, maybe Tune Summon Skull up there. Take a look. Let's see what we can get. We got Guardian of the Throne Room. We got Malevolent Nuzzler. Fire Kraken. Curse of Fiend. Manga Ryuran. I get this card every time. Mystic Plasma Zone. Umi Ruka. Performance of Sword, Boar Soldier. Okay, we're moving into the big three. We're on to the big three now. Let's go. Pharaoh's Servant or Metal Raiders? What should we do? Should we go? Should we go for the uh, the Jinzo? Let's go for Jinzo. Come on, bless us again. Bless us again, Legendary Collection. Let's uh, let's pack trick this out. So I think we're going three back. I think we're safe at three. Give us a little bit of extra extra boost here. We got Cold Wave. We got Invitation to a Dark Sleep. Four Star Ladybug of Doom. Regulation of the Tribe. Mystic Probe. We've got DNA Surgery. I think next card's it. World Suppression. And Appropriate. Man, we're getting nothing but trap cards in our packs. Oh, whoop, we got one more. Didn't count right. Shadow of Eyes. Ooh. Oh, that card's terrible. Shadow of Eyes is a terrible card. All right, Metal Raiders. Metal Raiders is uh, going to be Time Wizard. I've got Time Wizard a couple times before. Time Wizard's pretty good. Let's see what we got here. Uh-oh. I'm mangling these packs, though. Just mangling them. But, um... Oh, wait. We want to do a little pack trick. Let's do three again. I think we're always safe with three. We got Jirai Gumo, Niratori, the Immortal of Thunder, Baby Dragon, good old Joey card there. We got the Petite Moth, Hockey Beam, Uguchi, next one, Witch of the Black Forest, ouch, and Mushroom Man number two. All right, it all comes down to the legend of blue eyes, which is one that all matters. Can we get that blue eyes white dragon? Can we get an Exodia piece? Can we get a red eyes? Can we get a dark magician? The list goes on and on on the number of hits in these packs. 
Man, we started off hot with skill drain, but we just oh, we we haven't gotten any hollows yet. We got Kumo Toko. We've got Umi. We've got Tai Hone. Fire Grass. We've got Kam Gakage Musha with the Blue Flame. Beast Fangs. Monster Egg. Armed Ninja. Ouch. Oh my gosh. We better hope we got two. Dark World Thorns. Oh. Oh, they did us dirty. They did us dirty, guys. Oh. Ever since that Skill Drain. Skill Drain started us out hard. I made fun of Dark Crisis. And all we got was Skill Drain. It was, it was all that saved us on that. But, like I said... It's a fun set to open. It's it's great to get to see these packs and get to see, you know, the game board. And it's getting reprinted this year in all these sets. Legend of Blue Eyes and Spell Ruler and Pharaoh's Servant and everything. Like, getting to see this before. It's, if you've got one of these sets um, and you haven't opened it up, you probably want to keep it sealed for value. Um, but they're fun. Great to see these sets. Let me know which one of these sets is your favorite Obviously, these aren't the first set, uh, six. They're the first four, and then you skip a few because Labyrinth of Nightmare and like Legacy of Darkness get skipped over here. Magician's Force. Like, come on, guys. Tell me, what? why do you think that uh, Konami refuses to reprint Magician... Magi oh, my gosh. Having a, having a meltdown over here. Re refuses to reprint Magician's Force, right? Let, let's talk about this. Like, do they not want us getting more copies of Dark Magician Girl? Let me know, um, but leave a comment. Let me know which one of these six sets is your favorite. Um, maybe I should become a Dark Crisis fan here. Like, it's the only one that didn't let me down in this pack. Um, but enjoyed the opening. Enjoyed having you guys stop in to watch the video. Leave a comment. Be subscribed. Be entered into the giveaway for the structure deck, uh, Mechanized Madness. Um, and we hope to see you in the next video. We've got uh, Photon Hypernova coming out uh, in the next uh, week. And uh, we're looking forward to getting to open all these sets again as they drop the 25th anniversary release. 25 years old. Happy birthday, Yu-Gi-Oh, right? We'll catch you in the next one. Take care.